well, Jim, can can you tell us like what what are you like what are you anticipating for the next? I guess the the closeout of this year and maybe the start of next year. Are you all ramping things up? Or are you kind of taking the watch and wait approach? Or what what's your all's plan? If you don't mind sharing. Yeah, we are. Well, it's funny you brought you know I brought up Tennessee. We actually earlier this year had looked at 220 lots in Tennessee. We like Tennessee, and we decided no. Um, and we got out of the lots. Um, we were we were building Southwest Atlanta. Um, we're finishing a townhouse development there. But right now, that's really all we're doing. We're we're really going heavily into Florida. We like Florida. We want to focus our efforts and our teams there. Um, we understand Florida, so we at this point are are not planning to triple triple our builds or anything. But we want to stay at where we're at. And after having a record last twelve months, we want to stay where we're at. And it's simply because the demand's there. So we plan to stay status quo. When the pandemic started, we, we took a big risk. Uh, and we went into well over $20 million worth of land. We talked to people who I thought were way smarter than us. They said, I don't think this is going to crash the real estate market like 08. In fact, certain areas like where you are in low density, I think are going to do very well. It was advice. We took it. And so we don't have a problem with land right now. We have enough land in our hopper to build on for the next three years, where a lot of people are scrambling now to get the land and work deals with the builder. We are, we are self-build. So we're pretty insulated right now, which is exciting. So we plan to keep moving forward. That's our goal right now. Yes, material prices went up, which had to increase our prices um, as well. But the good news is values creeped up even more and the last thing to go, which finally has happened, is rents. Holy moly, have rents gone up in the last three months in ways that I've never seen in 23 years. Uh, so so we, we plan to, to have a very strong month and, and keep moving very steadily forward with just our low density, you know, one to four units, new construction, A properties and B areas in high growth areas in Florida. That's what we're doing and we're, we're going to stick to it. 